I laughed out loud, spotting the woman in the lounge in her pink robe eating cheese balls. That was so funny. And then we realize it's actually the lead character and her reflection upon herself, which is so comical. I think the film was well written and a favorite of mine, a good scene in the moment where the two women on their date are on the stairwell speaking about sharing difficult stories with each other and becoming closer. The film had a unique concept in that the dual character of the lead female was played for a good romantic relationship drama comedy. The opening where they display social media, really cool effect. I mean, her seeing herself in these all these various forms in this date in this pink robe, aggressively snacking, of course. I think it's a personification of her insecurity, but her inner thoughts, but mainly her grief. This is her grief. This is where she was and who she was in the midst of her grief. Um, this whole thing is all about grief and dealing with it in its various forms. And this first date back after a breakup can be really hard um, to get back out there. And I really appreciated the vulnerability in this. I think it was refreshing. And I think it was really the reason why they connected mainly is because they were both willing to be vulnerable with one another. I loved that we had these little flashbacks of her former self in the room while she's bringing home her date. Um, we kind of see her worst self um, you know, being messy, being sloppy, um, sort of embarrassing her and she's just having to kick it under the, the sofa um, and hide that part of herself while she's on her first date. You know, most of like most of us do while we're on our first date, we project our best selves and we try and hide those messier parts of ourselves. And here we have like a physical representation of that in this film, which I thought was cool. Um, and her messiest part of herself is her bad breakup and her grief over that. Um, and I appreciated how these two women slowly opened up about those parts of themselves on their first date even. I um, mean, that helped them grow closer together and helped them have that connection in the end and, and ended up having, uh, making it so that they could spend the night together and that she didn't, the other um, woman did not leave. Um, so I thought that was really cool, just showing how, um, showing the messier parts of ourselves can actually help with the connection in the first date and make it go even better. Um, so I love the slowly opening up to each other. I thought the acting was also really great in this film. Um, the actresses had really great chemistry in this. Um, and you could really feel their connection while they were talking. I think the subject matter can be awkward or tense and you take it in a way and you flip it on its head and make it really funny. I think you use situational comedy to your advantage in this, and you heighten it um, consistently throughout the piece. I think this character is very well thought out, and everything is very well planned, and it's acted. The comedic timing by this actress is very, very well done as well. Um, yeah, it was just overall very enjoyable. The script was well done. I think um, the different cuts in the in the editing that you do in this as well it's about putting yourself back out there whether you have gone through a loss of relationship whether it be familial or intimate wise you know sometimes it's difficult in putting yourself out there and um, taking a risk to get someone to get to know you and not only get to know you but get to know the painful parts of you the things that you carry and this is about giving a new chance, a new opportunity of showing your vulnerability and falling for someone. Here you have two different characters fighting different battles, but have the same commonality of attraction and alluring nature to one another. They both want to enjoy and spend time with each other. They both want to be present. They both want to be in this moment and they like each other. They get along. But there are things that are keeping them from going uh, essentially all the way in. And uh, throughout the day, they find these explorations and go through this experience together. And if it weren't for them taking a risk and having communication and having this conversation, it wouldn't have developed to uh it end of a good day. They ended up spending the night and, you know, uh, essentially got to have that moment together, uh, despite the hardships that 
made the relationship real, taking their time and really knowing that sometimes you just have to make the moves to move forward. I thought it was sweet. I thought it was heartfelt. Uh, it hit me in the feels, which I guess I think I'm projecting that might have been its goal. You know, I thought it was uh, the acting was great. I thought the two uh, the two girls had chemistry. Um, I thought it was well written and like genuine came from like a genuine place instead of a this would be good for emotion place. You know what I mean? 